I'm Darren Marlar, and this is your Daily Dose of Weird News. Facebook pulled the Feeling Fat emoticon from its list of status updates on Tuesday after an online petition called for its removal. Grad student and playwright Catherine Weingarten, alongside the advocacy group Endangered Bodies, had launched a petition on Change.org calling for the status's removal last month. Weingart said when people see feeling fat on Facebook, I want them to realize that it's not just a light, cute sort of thing for everyone. Yeah, sounds like somebody's a bit too sensitive about their weight, fatty Kathy. During her Tuesday press conference, not only did Hillary Clinton use a private email address as Secretary of State, she says she ran it from her own private computer system. We're betting that did have a reset button that worked. Scientists have mapped the loudest and quietest places in America. The loudest places were New York City, Los Angeles, and Dallas. The quietest was any theater showing Hot Tub Time Machine 2. A jury on Tuesday voted unanimously to award members of Marvin Gaye's family $7.4 million as a result of their suit against Robin Thicke, Farrell Williams, and T.I. over copyright infringement. They felt Thicke's 2013 mega-hit Blurred Lines was a rip-off of Gay's 1977 hit song, Got to Give It Up. Blurred Lines. Gee, you know what? I, I don't think I've heard that since it was played nine million times in the last year and a half. I'm glad Thick lost that suit just to punish him for what he did to my ears. Police in Florida are searching for a suspect who stole 75 panties worth $1,188 from a Victoria's Secret store. That's no wonder they stole them. Do the math and that's over 15 bucks for a single pair of underwear. Who can afford that? Students at a private high school in Albuquerque have voted to have a communism-themed prom. At midnight, they'll leave their prom, roll into a nearby town, and take over that school's prom. If a Mercedes or Range Rover SUV are a bit too low rent for your lifestyle, Rolls-Royce has the family hauler for you. The Rolls-Royce Cullinan, named after the famed 3,000-carat diamond, is coming in 2018. The SUV will have a sticker of $340,000. You know, if it comes with its own full-time driver and you deal with Chicago traffic, it might be worth it. That's your Daily Dose of Weird News. I'm Darren Marlar. Get more weird news anytime, anywhere at DailyDoseOfWeirdNews.com. You can join the Weird News Facebook group, download the free app for Apple or Android, subscribe to my YouTube channel, sign up for my newsletter, visit me on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, and more. Check it out at DailyDoseOfWeirdNews.com. Until next time, keep it real. Weird. Hey, thanks for watching, and if you like what you saw, do me a favor and give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Be sure to also click that little gear icon next to the subscribe button and select send me updates so you'll be notified when I post new videos.